All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach, it's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Oh, effective strike there by Burrell. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, beautiful lead of the body by him there. Again, we talked off the top about his size advantage, and he put it to good use there. Kick lands. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Burrow gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. That one snuck in. Nice strike. They're certainly getting after it early. Boy gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. Oh, and he lands another knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, he leads with a power right hand there, DC. That'll work. Really sat down on that right hand. Well, missed on that one. See if he can finish. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Try to establish that jab. Just out of range with that strike. Straight right, he misses. He gets a turtle in that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, wow! Head kick! Big knee to the body! Just misses with the straight right. Devastating uppercut. Just out of range with that right hook. Blocks that strike. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Sneaky head kick. Burrow's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Ooh, blocks the shot. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice strike. Oh, nice combination of strikes there in terms of the accuracy. I mean, that's exactly what a coach is looking for. That's exactly. It's like the guy is hitting pads. It's like he's hitting focus spins, but instead, he's dancing all over his opponent's feet. Uh, huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Punch is blocked. Morale gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Right hook to the body. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. And he landed the right hand there. Final seconds here of round one. 
Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that right, time. Oh, oh, oh. All right, there's the horn, and what a round it was. DC take us through the replays. Punch after punch. He landed him at will. He went right at his opponent, got in his face, and showed this is my octagon. We are going to dance to the beat of my tune. He's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Back and forth we go here. Just misses with the right. Oh, strong punch there, bite short. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Right hand punch the clinch. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. He's landing him upside his opponent's head over and over again. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Damaging punch there. Unable to land with that punch. And he continues to work the body here. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, misses with the jab. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Nice head kick. Oh, single collar tie here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Nice knees to the body. Well placed kick there by Barouse. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. Oh, right there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Watch the shot. Oh, straight right. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. An uppercut in it. He's giving him so many different things right now. That was a jab. Back to the jab now. No good. Oh, nice. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. <laughs> Straight right hand now just misses. Oh, that's a nice strike. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, knee strike right to the body. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Takedown attempt late in the round and he gets it. 
Barrow's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Oh, that right hand is on point. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. That right hand landing. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with foul. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Right the start All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went headhunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't headhunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. Final round, you ready? Third round underway. What a body kick. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. A series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. It's very tricky when he throws that body Man, look at the redness now, almost immediately on the right side of his body. Nice. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe still standing after taking that one. Got clipped with the right hand. Ground and pound by Choi. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. There. Very accurate. A lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal. Man. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Oh. Oh. Look at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Sides with conviction. Joy gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Oh! Oh, he might be out. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. 
Isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motion on the mat. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Burrell. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. Well, he's in a Do you believe it? And that'll do it! Oh! What a performance! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Morgliot has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 53 seconds of round number three. Going the winner by 